Hello, Ms. Jones. My name is Dante, and I'm going to be your CNA today. I'm here to assist you with your bedpan. Does that sound fair enough? It does. Okay, wonderful. Real quick, can I just take a look at your wristband? Okay, it is you. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to go wash my hands, and I'm going to gather my supplies. So I exit the room, wash my hands, and I come back with my supplies. For this, I'm going to be using three barriers and her the hand, hand towelettes or the wipes, her toilet paper, and she will need a bedpan, and I'm also gonna use a bath blanket. I start by getting my barrier, and I will put the barrier on the table. So that way I can put on my, I can put my clean supplies on top of a clean surface. So I'm gonna have this clean side. I am gonna utilize this area over here as my dirty area though. This is gonna be a dirty area where I'm only gonna contact once. Now, what I will do is I will close the curtains for privacy, and I'm going to get my the rest of my supplies, which is going to be some toilet paper. I got to go over to the bathroom where they keep the uh, the bedpan. So I got the bedpan, and the bedpan is also now on my surface. At this point, I'm going to uh, assist the patient to uh, raise their bed to my waist level, and I'm going to lower the head of the bed so the patient is flat. Now I'm going to get my bath blanket. I got my bath blanket. I put my bath blanket on the patient. Now this is uh, to keep you warm while I while you use the bath the, the bedpan and also to give you some privacy. I didn't snap or shake the the linens. If you can hold one edge and I can hold this side that way I can remove your blanket so that way it stays clean. I'm going to bring your, your your actual blanket to about underneath your toes, but I'm going to keep it on the bed, okay? All right, excellent. This is where I'm going to put on my first set of gloves. Glove dispenser. I don my gloves. I'm going to now be able to get your chuck. I see I have a, a blue chuck. It looks white, but this is a blue chuck. A little waterproof pad. I'm going to unfold it and I'm going to roll it clean towards me. You roll dirty away from you, but clean rolls towards you. I will then place this right underneath the patient. Since I'm wearing gloves, I'm going to ask Mrs. Jones to bend her knees and if she can lift her buttocks so that way I can roll the chuck underneath her. Now the chuck is rolled out underneath the patient. I'm gonna go ahead and ask you just to relax for a second while I get your bedpan. I now have a bedpan. And now I'm gonna ask you to do that one more time. If you can bend your knees and lift your buttocks, I'm gonna place the bedpan right into position. And now you're on the bedpan. Okay, at, at this moment, I am going to remove my gloves. I'm going to put them in the trash. I'm going to state, I'm going to sanitize my hands. Hands are now sanitized. So I can touch her personal area, her personal belongings, like her remote control. Now I'm going to raise the head of the bed so she's in a sitting position. And I'm going to lower the bed to its lowest position so that way she's safe. I'm going to hand you your call light. I'm going to go right over here. I'm going to get uh, gather my... Uh, my supplies here, you have your towelettes and your paper and your, your toilet paper. And I have one more barrier. I'm gonna use this a little later, okay? I'm gonna remove this barrier. And if this is a soil linen, it would go into the hamper. If it was another chuck, it would go in the trash. It's in this designated area. I'm gonna place these articles in reach for you. So that way when you're uh, done, you can go ahead and wipe your hands and you can uh, towel or toilet paper off, okay? All right, very good. Um, I'm gonna be on the other side of the curtain, okay? And I'll be waiting for you for when you're done. Bing, 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 she's done. All right, Mrs. Jones, I see you're ready. So I'm now going to remove the bedpan for you from you, okay? I'm gonna get the remote control. I'm gonna lift you up to waist level for body mechanics. I'm going to lower the bed so that way it is low. 
I'm now going to reach and grab my second pair of gloves. My second pair of gloves have been donned. And now I can go ahead and ask you to bend your knees so I can now remove. Oh, real quick, before I even come in contact with removing that bedpan, I almost forgot to get these articles and put this into its designated area. This has already been discarded because she used it. But I want to put my, my barrier down. The barrier is now down. My gloves are still on. And now I'm going to go ahead and ask you to bend your knees. Now I'm going to wrap the uh, as best I can the uh, the, the uh, chuck over the uh, bedpan so to prevent spilling. I don't want it to spill. So to prevent spilling, I'm going to cover that bedpan so it's all covered up so it doesn't spill or splash. I'll place this onto my bedside stand barrier. Now I'm going to remove this set of gloves and throw those in the trash. Stating sanitizes hands. So I can now cover you up with your original blanket, all right? I have your original blanket here. Those underneath are on, on, are still on your bed. And now I'm gonna go ahead and cover you up. Can I ask you to hold that corner of it? All right, thank you. That way I can take down this bath blanket. The bath blanket has now been removed. I will then place the bath blanket without touching my scrubs, keeping it away. This will go into its soiled linen hamper. Now I've done that bed, I'm gonna place down to its lowest position again. I'm gonna level the head of the bed to its maximum comfort for you, Mrs. Jones, making sure you still have your call light in reach. Now I'm going to grab my third pair of gloves. Gloves go on. I can now think about my closing steps, which is gonna be removing the, uh, the, bed, the, the bedpan and coming back to check in on you, okay? I will go ahead and remove my barrier, put that in its designated area. I'm gonna travel over to the bathroom where I will get my barrier and put that in the trash can. I can then lift the seat, pour the contents into the trash, into the toilet. I will get a paper, turn on the faucet, rinse the inside of the bedpan pour those contents into the toilet, get another paper towel to seal off the water and throw that in the, the paper towel in the trash and get another paper towel to wipe the, the surface. Get another one, just wipe any excess water from the bedpan, throw that in the trash. This will then go into its designated area and it looked like I originally grabbed this from the bathroom. So this can stay in the bathroom. Oh, this is goes in the trash. This is all trash. I'm just going to put it over here. So now that I finished from the bathroom, okay, I'm going to take off my gloves, throw my gloves away. I can come over to the patient and now I can observe Mrs. Jones to make sure that she still has her call light. Her bed is still at the lowest position. She is still comfortable. And now I can ask if there's anything else she needs. If not, go ahead and call me with the call light. All right. I'm going to undo privacy. I'm going to wash my hands and the skill is complete.